The muddy sandbox isn't just a place for digging and building, it's a bustling microcosm of life. Beneath the damp soil and squishy puddles, tiny creatures like ants, beetles, and worms go about their daily routines, tunneling through the earth and scavenging for food. Meanwhile, curious lizards dart between patches of sunlight, hunting for unsuspecting insects. This miniature ecosystem is full of surprises, where every scoop of mud reveals a hidden drama of survival. Red iguanas spend much of their time in trees, using their strong legs and sharp claws to climb and cling to branches. Red iguana is known for its striking bright red or reddish-orange coloration, which makes it stand out compared to other iguanas. Yellow jackets are often confused with bees, but they're actually a type of wasp. Sleeker, shinier, and more aggressive. Yellow jackets live in colonies, sometimes with over 1,000 individuals, including a queen, workers, and drones. Dung battles often look like tiny wrestling matches, with beetles pushing, rolling, and flipping each other. Male dung beetles often battle over dung balls, which are used to attract mates or feed larvae. To a dung beetle, Rhinoceros beetles get their name from the horn-like structures on their heads, which resemble a rhino's horn. Males use these horns to fight other males for mates or territory. Rhinoceros beetles are among the largest beetles in the world, with some species growing over 6 inches. Stag beetles can range in size from 2.5 to 12 centimeters, 1 to 4.7 inches, depending on the species. Males are generally larger than females. Stag beetles can fly, but they're slow and clumsy. Males are often seen flying at dusk looking for mates. Honeybees live in colonies with a complex social structure, including a queen bee, worker bees, and drones. Honeybees build honeycombs in hexagonal cells, which are incredibly efficient for storing honey and raising brood. Honeybees make honey by collecting nectar, Frilled neck lizards are native to northern Australia and parts of southern New Guinea. This lizard is named for the large frill around its neck, which it can suddenly fan out when threatened. The frill is made of skin and cartilage. Frilled neck lizards are excellent climbers. Ants colony has different castes, queens, egg layers, workers, females that do tasks, and males for mating. Ants build complex nests with tunnels and chambers that can regulate temperature and humidity. Ants are incredibly strong for their size, Spiders are arachnids, not insects. 
they have eight legs and two body parts, while insects have six legs and three body parts. Spiders don't chew food. They inject digestive enzymes into prey, turning it into liquid, which they suck up. Spiders make different types of webs. Ladybugs are beneficial insects because they eat pests like aphids, mites, and scale insects that damage plants. Ladybugs live for about one year, going through complete metamorphosis, egg, larva, pupa, and adult. Horseflies are loud and fast with a powerful buzzing sound as they fly. Horseflies are attracted to movement, dark colors, and heat, so they often target horses, cattle, and people. Horseflies can smell CO2 and body odors, helping them locate Scorpions have two large claw-like pincers, pedipalps, and a long, curved tail with a venomous stinger. Scorpions are widely distributed across the globe, from Africa to the Americas, but they do not live in Antarctica. Scorpions often pinch rather than sting when threatened. Red iguanas spend much of their time in trees, using their strong legs and sharp claws to climb and cling to branches. Red iguana is known for its striking bright red or reddish-orange coloration, which makes it stand out Alligators are cold-blooded reptiles and belong to the same order as crocodiles, but they are different animals. Alligators eat fish, birds, turtles, mammals, and even carrion, dead animals. They wait quietly in water and lunge at prey with powerful jaws. Butterflies taste with their feet. Their taste sensors are located on their feet, allowing them to detect the right plants for laying eggs. Butterflies transform from caterpillars into adults through a process called metamorphosis. Snakes have no legs but can move quickly and quietly using their muscles and scales. Some snakes lay eggs, while others give birth to live young. Snakes flick their tongues to taste the air and pick up scent particles, which helps them find prey. Snakes don't have eyelids. Leopard geckos are named after their spotted skin, which resembles a leopard's coat. Leopard geckos are fascinating and popular reptiles, especially loved by reptile enthusiasts and pet owners. Leopard geckos are gentle, low maintenance, and easy to care for. and predator-prey interactions. Insects are the unsung architects of this muddy world. Ants build intricate underground colonies, 
while beetles and centipedes navigate the damp terrain like seasoned explorers.